Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the Electric Israeli, and thank you for joining my channel. If you're new, please subscribe and help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all of my patrons and those who ordered the Tesla using my referral code. I'm still in South Florida, and uh, I want to wish everybody a Happy New Year. Um, I hope you had a wonderful time. This is uh, a lousy weather this whole week. This vacation being nothing but rain. But that's okay. We'll warm our hearts with a good, good video. And it's time, because it's a new, it's time to uh, point out the amazing 2019 that Tesla had. And I give you, month by month, one thing that was incredible. Starting in January 2019, all the way now, it's going to be quick. So don't nobody go nowhere. January, the Shanghai factory broke ground. And 10 months later, it was completely unbelievable february the first two quarters in 15 years in a row that tesla shows profitability that's that's in 2018 quarter four and a, 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 a three and four of 2018 that's amazing in march the model y was introduced was revealed in california and a year later hopefully the people will start uh, seeing model y's on the road April, major losses of quarter one of 2019, uh, and Tesla was compared to uh, Theranos and Elizabeth Holmes as a tech a tech company that fell. Uh, uh, you know, Silicon Valley a tech company that fell. That it, it was ridic ridiculed. In 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 May of 2019. Tesla took a 2.5 billion dollars uh, raise of money to try to stay afloat and to fulfill orders and people said this is going to be the beginning of the end of Tesla. Things got worse in June when more losses came to be in the second quarter and the Tesla stock went down to $170 and some analysts, self-declare analysts, declare a Tesla stock to go down to $10 and even to zero. In July, in July, uh, the uh, sales of Tesla Model 3 almost reached 100,000. And they showed a tiny bit of, uh, of uh, profit. In August, Adam Jonas, who is a Morgan Stanley analyst, said that the fundamental of Tesla stock is overvalued and the strategic uh, Tesla stock is undervalued. He, he was a bull. He goes back and forth. But that was interesting what he said in uh, August. In September, the Porsche Taycan was introduced and it was going to be the absolute definite 100% Tesla killer with a whopping 200 miles range. No, it was not, and it will not be. October, Model S was deemed by uh, this, by Elon Musk as having a sentimental value, and eventually it will not be produced, just uh, maybe just produced for some people who really want it as a sentimental value. In other words, it served its purpose, and it's going to be phased out. I don't believe that, but we'll see. In November, my favorite month of all time, actually, I'm taking it back. My second favorite month of all time in 2019 was the introduction of the Tesla Cybertruck. Me, the electric Israeli, who never owned a truck in his life and said repeatedly on this channel that I am not a customer of the Tesla Cybertruck. Within a few hours, I placed an order for the dual motor and three days later, or five days later, or something day, some days later, I upgraded to the triple motor of the Tesla Model Y. And the first thing I'm planning to do with it is to take it across country. And in December, this month that we just finished, this is my favorite month because Tesla stock went up to $430. Uh, and uh, a lot of people made a lot of money and the short sellers literally lost their shorts. Not literally, but you know, they lost probably $8 billion. And now Tesla is stuck. Tesla value is 
$25 billion more than GM. How ironic. Stress and the ick. Unbelievable. Thank you guys for watching. Give me a thumbs up. I hope you enjoyed this roller coaster of a year of 2019. And I'll see you tomorrow. Happy New Year, everybody. Please subscribe. Become a patron. Help me change the world one electric car at a time.